Gross anyway. Gross. It says it's what? 40. 40 degrees? I didn't even wear a jacket to work today because I thought it was, it was so warm. And then I came out and I'm like, oh, I'm freezing and I'm sick. What is going on guys? Welcome to Family Time Vlogs FTV date night. Rough start. We went to um, Willowbrook Mall and uh, Yard House is an hour and a half wait. So then we'll go, we're like, oh, we'll go to Cheesecake Factory. Nobody goes there anymore. That's like an hour wait. So finally across the street, there's a Bahama Breeze. So we called them, they said 25 minutes. So we're gonna go to Bahama Breeze now. We haven't been to Bahama Breeze, oh my God, since like what, high school? Mm -hmm. Years, right? So uh, I can't believe it's still there. We'll check it out and see how it is. out just in time. This is a menu. Good vibes only. I'm trying to figure out what kind of margarita we want. Alright guys, I don't know if you can hear me or not, but we uh, are at Bahama Breeze. We just lucked out. It's nuts everywhere. Uh, like I said in the car, we tried to get to other places and it's just mob. And as soon as we got here, it got mob too. So, we were able to get a spot. We put our order in, we got ultimate margaritas. Can't wait for those. And uh, we got tacos. We got taco food. Taco dinners. And then we're gonna go to the movies after. I just noticed how pretty your nails are. They're old. Oh. Yeah. Let's see, you messed up. Nice. What's that? Yeah, mine. Okay. Okay. No, it's fine. I like don't care. Okay. It's like So far, the apps in Margarita are fire. I lost the gingerbread house. Thank you. I lost the date night. I lost. Uh, yeah, you in online. Uh, YouTube. Yeah, the subscribers like they said our house is gonna win, and then they thought the Mickey was too much, and then it fell apart. So, so I always lose. So no, I don't want to do another challenge. I'm good with luck. All right, we'll do a date night challenge. Next date night. If it's not skill or thinking, I always win. If it's luck, you win. Yeah, that's true. You want to trade? You want guac and Yeah, you want my guac? You can have it. All right, I'm gonna use it. You want to move for guac? You want it? You want it? You want my guac? First thing, French fries. The French fries. Good. Not bad. Needs ketchup, but I like them. Alright, I'm gonna try one of these tacos real quick. Black and Mahi Mahi. Gotta go back. Let me take another bite. Um. 
definitely not the best tacos I ever had. So, meh. I th yeah, I think I got the wrong thing. My, my fish seems a little dried out. I bet you fried fish is better with this. Coconut shrimp is good. It is? Yeah. The sauce on it, though. Well, you got sauce on that. Yeah, but that's different. I want that. <laughs> a million times better. I used a sauce that came with the conch. Now it's like phenomenal. You doing the brim? I'm putting some sauce in there. Oh, I just saw you put it on the brim. I was just wiping my fork. Up. Hey, Bahama breeze was very, very good. Uh, wasn't amazing. But it was good. And uh, it beat the wait times of the other places. We just now, a couple minutes ago, got a text from um, Yard House that our table is ready. Cheesecake never test tested us, texted us back. So I'd still be waiting at che for Cheesecake Factory. It is weird. Unless they got the number wrong, but. So I just hit C to cancel. And now we're off to the movies and I want to talk to you guys a little bit about the movie. We're gonna go see, we were debating on whether to see A Man Named Otto with Tom Hanks or Megan. And we ultimately decided we're gonna go see Megan. Megan just looks a little bit better. And we're hearing it's getting really, really good reviews. So we're gonna check it out and we're gonna let you guys know how Megan is. And then I did watch a trailer. I don't like to watch trailers because it kind of spoils you, but I watched the trailer for A Man Named Otto and it just was, it fell kind of flat for me. Even though I love, love, love Tom Hanks. When I booked this movie, there's quite a bit of seats left and now it's a sold out show. We're at the lo local AMC, it's packed. Everybody had a date night tonight. I'm like so nice to people. I'll block you. How? Oh yeah, you're gonna be on one and I'm gonna be on the other, sorry. Oh, I was gonna say, oh the food was delicious so. Needed oh, sauce. Packed. No more, so we had the whole road or so. Oh yeah, but that's because there was nobody in there. It was empty. Well, we went like in the morning. Us. Oh, that's true. I went in the first row. <laughs> I like to get the front row. The front row. Near the front. Like the fourth row. Yeah. But once you put the sauce on that chicken or on the tacos, it was phenomenal. All right, Mom, what you think? It's good. What did you give it? I know what I give it. Yeah. You just say first. Say. Six. A six? Oh, you didn't like it? I liked it. It wasn't like amazing. I, I, I liked it a lot. Uh, I give it an eight. Yeah. Uh, it wasn't really horror. It was uh, more suspense to me, right? And I liked one thing, like uh, a lot of times when you go see horror movies in the theater, everybody laughs and stuff. They had a lot of laughing parts in this movie, funny parts. So it's like I was laughing with people. Um, but I liked it a lot. I enjoyed it. It was a good suspense movie. I wouldn't say horror at all. Um, I only jumped one part and that's when the dog, <laughs> um, if you see it, you'll know what I'm talking about, but it's when the dog scared me, right? It's a pretty cool movie. Um, yeah, yeah, I give it an eight. You're stuck in what a six? Yeah, that's kind of predictable. Everything. Yeah, you're right. It was, it was predictable. You knew what was yeah, you're right. You're right about that. You're right. You're right. You're right. Dave's hot chicken? What look at there? You see that? Yeah. I wanna go. 
But I would definitely recommend it. I would. I wouldn't. I don't know if I'd watch it again. There was one scene I really <laughs> liked when she was dancing in the hall. Like, what was that? That was awesome, wasn't it? Yeah. I was like, whoa. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a cool movie. Mm. Very cool. So, guys, I'm trying to think. Uh, my favorite movie of 2022, 2023 still will remain Avatar Way of the Water. Very close second, maybe tied with Top Gun Maverick. You? 2022, your avatar wasn't? Yeah, I guess. What was better? Nothing. Uh, but we're gonna end date night here. We're gonna go home, have a couple cocktails, watch some YouTube, and go to sleep. Probably. And, uh,. We got some big news coming up. I'm not gonna tell you now. As soon as we make it official, I'll do an FTV Dad talk about it, which should be very, very soon. Uh, but big news, big things on the horizon. Say bye, Mom. Bye, Mom. Peace.